so my name is Alyosha, I'm Shaper of Lapis and we are in Friedrichshafen stand, uh, climbholds.com. <laughs> Did you bring new stuff? <laughs> yeah, this year we have loads of new stuff which I really, really like. I carved this in the last, uh, in the last year. Uh, we um, focused on our logo which is a petal and we, we came out of those uh, logos and we did um, lots of new stuff pockets screens edges slopers everything yeah we have uh, we have a dual dual stuff um, which is uh, a little bit different and and uh, normal style of, of macros which are also a little bit smaller not not just the big ones we have this uh, this um, bricks that you can um, combine with the old uh, um, Syria that we have and yeah that's it we have also a competition line now developing uh, which will be a dual text um, we, we combine it with uh, 23 line and those are the shells there's 10 pieces of those for now and then we have a dual text the petals as well also competition line named 23 and then the, the rest of it it's, it's lapis and it's more a, let's say a commercial style but of course you can use it in, in for the comps as well and i'm really excited to 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 try them on the wall because i haven't yet yeah yeah i sent them i love them will we see more of them like yeah hopefully yeah yeah, yeah i love them I'm Frank, Frank Bogerman from Access Climbing Holds. We are here at Vertical Pro, the holes and walls and uh, the craziest hold show in the world, I think. It's, it, it is. Maybe more holds than you can ever dream of. We brought some new holds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have holds, new holds, new volumes, some new macros and uh, dual techs, no dual techs, everything. I think everything is a little bit new for me. So we start here with the first two dual text discs. It's going to be a bigger set than this two. Uh, they will come. Um, coming here, we have them in production, but this is the first two easy teasers on the wall here. It's nice. I've, uh, first time I see them, so it's nice. <laughs> After I shaped them. Yeah, yeah. The sliders is a little bit of a concept that's coming out of the classic range. We have some, some similar holds in the classic range um, that are a little bit more positive or slopey. And we're going to extend that range. Those holds are going to be in the slider range as well with all kinds of connecting angles. This is all 20 degrees between the holds. So it's a sloper on 20 degrees or a little bit in cut on 20 degrees and some pinches in the middle big white pinches a bit open so they all connect to each other angle wise but they don't connect shape wise okay. so they they never close completely you can slide them along each other and you always have some little edge opening up or closing down so it's a and then we have this is the 20 degree one it's going to be a zero degree, so it's perpendicular to the wall, or 40 degrees, so really juggy in-cut, and those and also holds connecting. So they're also going to be normal resin holds, PE, connecting to these to have uh, lots of fun setting with them. New plywood, very basic stuff, plywood volumes. They're going to be extending the range of normal volumes with T-nuts, or without, you can choose, but these normal volumes, it's always nice to have them with T-nuts. Um, these are the cones, two sets, they connect to each other. This one is, is mirrored to this one, so they, they fit on top of each other to form one big one. 
and this is the same. These, these sides are the same, so they connect to make it in, into one bigger one, yeah. or you can slide them alongside each other. Uh, excess like sliding. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a, looks also really sliding. So. This is very, very sliding. Um, it's 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 maybe a little bit too new school for me, but <laughs> that that's me. Um, no, these are really nice for for competition setting. This is just a normal plywood hold. Uh, dual text looks really nice. Yeah, useful in some ways, and and, and maybe 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 we'll see we'll see. It, nice it, 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 it's a nice addition, it's really a comp one. Extra volumes, the quads. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's three shapes. One shape connects if you buy four. It's a circle, it's, and they all have it, but they all connect to each other because it's a perpendicular to the wall. Uh, and if you buy four of these, you have one really big ball on the wall, so it changes the wall really in, in, a, in a big way, uh, in a big way. And then of course, discs, excess discs. More discs is always useful. Uh, <laughs> no, we, we took the time to really extend the disc range this time. 13 new sets from slightly positive, uh, quite, quite positive. It's never going to be a jerk. A disc is never going to be a jerk, so it's always slopey, a little bit in-cut, or, or very slopey, like, like the old school X from, from 17, or 12, 17. It's, it's always going to be like this. Uh, some edges, some footholds, really difficult. You can, you can think you can stand on top, and then you think, oh, maybe it's better to stand inside, but then your shoe is a little bit too big for it, so you pop out anyway. It's nice. It's good. It's nice. And then some edges. Small uh, edges number one, two, and three. Three sets. These are really edgy and crimpy. Crimpy, crimpy stuff. These are a little bit round. And these are a little bit longer. It's it just all one idea, and I designed them so they can be easily used to go alongside the, the, the edges of the volumes. So with a lot of nice volumes, maybe even in hold color, you can make easy problems. Or a little bit harder if you put a little bit more slopey one on the side and it changes the wall in a nice way. Uh, that's, it. that's it. We have still fins, but they are old school. So. <laughs>
hurts my arms. No, it's like, it, it, I think it's a little bit less than a meter, maybe one meter. It's uh, one of the standard macros and features. Uh, for some people it might be too big, for some people it might be atrocious, but we think this is just a really conti good continuous uh, extension of our range. So that's it so far from Blowstone. If you have any other questions, let us know. Uh, we hope you enjoy the shapes and uh, the holes. So see you soon. Bye. We're here at our Captain Crux booth at the Vertical Pro and uh, many of you, I hope all of you already know the red line by Captain Crux. Polyurethane produced in Aragon in the United States. Really crimpy, uh, different kind of sizes and shapes and inclines. But we thought PU is good, but we need it bigger. So we shaped four more huge red jugs. They are not curled back, they are always a little bit open. If you turn them around you can stand on the lip. Beautiful red, beautiful size and they are really really light because they are macros. So come on over, let's have a look and if you want to have a touch uh, and have a climb on them you will see them in a few gyms close to you hopefully soon. also has a lot of new stuff, a lot of new shapes and additions, even a new range. Behind me we find uh, the Ondas, shaped by Mauro, by Mauro himself. We've seen them already uh, at Copa, at the Lead World Cup, and we will see them soon again at Studio Blockmasters and probably other World Cups. Um, I think the macro range goes from small, which is uh, almost half an arm, like 30-40 centimeters, to really, really big and really, really deep. Uh, volumes, uh, a lot of different shapes and I know that there's polyurethane coming, smaller holes coming for the Onda range as well. Let's take a look at the other stuff. The Unos are already well known, uh, always like one grabbing option, but uh, they have uh, brothers and sisters. Uh, they are like tiny mini Unos, here beautiful yellow, again also only one uh, grabbing option, uh, different slopers, pockets, slopes, uh, and a fun sized, uh, I think the diameter is like 20 centimeters, uh, like, a, like a really good pancake. Uh, they taste worse, but uh, they look as beautiful as an American pancake, and uh, they have beautiful dimples and dishes. I'm, I think they're quite sexy. Everyone knows uh, the Dadao macros, um, and they are well known all over the world, but there is a PU range adjacent to it like which goes from small crimps pinches to bigger ones uh, which are almost as big as a katana sharp like a sword and uh, just really comfy to climb on and that's why we wanted to show them again so that's it from Scratra. Uh, if you have any other questions comments or concerns let us know what you think about it if you have any questions about our ring uh, let us know that's it so far from the trade show here at Vertical Pro. Nikki out. Bye.
uh, we got our holes here as well. Uh, our reset holes. We got more polyurethane over here, new stuff. And then we also brought our buddies, new plywood volumes. Ah, beautiful yellow. A lot of you already know our dual tax volumes and the full tax volumes, but we added more holes, 80 polyurethane, dual tax shapes, uh, really, uh, you use them for a really delicate setting in the commercial environment or just go full on, jib them wherever you want in commercial setting.